As we told you yesterday, students in East Providence will also walk through the doors of a brand new building this week. Tonight, 12 News reporter Kayla Fish gives us a closer look at the new building and the impact the mayor says it's already having on the city as a whole. New school year, new school building. That's the case for East Providence High School students who will be learning inside a state of the art facility when school begins later this week. Status is on time and on the budget. We're very excited that students will be starting school. As 12 News has previously reported, the former high school was built in 1952 and was deemed one of the lowest quality high school buildings in the state. What now has taken its place is a complete 180. They should be very proud and happy that their students are going to have a first-rate uh, facility with first-rate educators in place. And those educators will be teaching everything from English and science to hands-on training in the trades like carpentry and framing. And it's all under one roof. There's no stigma. Everyone's in it together. And if you're taking Algebra 3 or you're taking advanced uh, calculus, but you also want to take elect uh, electrical uh, classes and learn about, you know, wiring stuff, that possibility exists now. With the new building comes new learning opportunities. I mean, there's things now that were not available before. We have science rooms, we have a, an agricultural room, we have a grow house, uh, we have uh, a mock-up emergency response vehicle, a rescue, so that so that uh, students can learn to be EMTs. You can come out of, you're going to be able to come out of these problems high school and find gainful employment right away. The mayor tells 12 News the school upgrade is also leading to growth in the city. People are looking to move into these province because they know what's happening here with this school. So when you hear about homes don't stay long on the market in these provinces because young families are starting to move in. And since this building is new to everyone, the mayor tells us that every student class by class will have an opportunity to get familiar with the building and find out where things are located. Classes begin on Thursday. In East Providence, I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.